Hello fellow deceivers and overachievers, I'm Val the Blackthorn Mawile, and I'm bringing you, well, you've probably seen this layout, you've probably seen this format, so you would know that this is the Pokemon Showdown Replay Center. And basically, I have actually been training myself for a VGC championship kind of thing with the VGC 2015 regional autumn blah you guys get what I mean but basically it's coming up and on the 19th I'm actually planning on going to the regionals in San Jose and battling yeah cuz I think it'll be fun but anyways I decided that during my training if there were ever any really amazing plays whether it be from myself or my enemy I decided that I'd put it up on my channel and show you guys so without any further ado we're just gonna go ahead and get on into this now all right so we're gonna go ahead and there was a team layout there my thoughts was that it was going to be Zapdos and Garchomp first obviously I got the Garchomp right the and I figured, you know, if any Pokemon was going to take down any of my Pokemon, it would be that Gardevoir. Because I've actually got a plan for Garchomp. You guys can see what I mean. But, um, yeah, I actually have a plan for Garchomp. And, yeah, we're going to get into it. So, actually, what he does is he sends out Garchomp and Gengar first. So, I ended up sending out Gudra and Crobat, obviously expecting certain plays. But this was actually a good matchup for me, too. See, what I actually did was I have a Hobbenberry on my Gudra, so I target the Garchomp, hoping to take it down, as well as I taunted the Gengar, expecting a Will-O-Wisp onto my Crobat. But I Dragon Pulse Garchomp, bringing him down all the way to the bottom. He returns his Gengar next turn and sends out Zapdos. So with that, I actually decided to switch out my Gudra as well for my Meowstic because I knew that if I didn't, my Gudra would end up dying. I take it, and I take it pretty well to be honest, and I ended up U-turning onto Garchomp, which also gave me a bit of switch initiative against the Zapdos, but also he gets a bit of the switch initiative, quote unquote, because, well, he'll see what Pokemon I send out before he sends out his next Pokemon. And I send out Greninja knowing that it's faster and with the Protean ability. And now, first thing I decide to do is safeguard just in case of Thunder Wave and Mat Block because I don't expect him to use a Will-O-Wisp on either of these guys. But a Shadow Ball comes in, and a Volt Switch ends up coming in as well. And with that, that worked out perfectly. Next turn, I Swagger, revealing to him that I actually have a physical Greninja taking down Gengar and Zapdos without the same amount of health and showing that that is one bulky Zapdos uh, while he takes out my Meowstic. But that's alright because Meowstic did do his part. The Volt Switch does go off, does not take him down uh, all the way to his Sash, but takes him down to a little below half. I still have my Greninja here. He sends out Gardevoir. Here comes in my Crobat. Now, what I was thinking here is I'll Shadow Snake Gengar and I'll Cross Poison Gardevoir, knowing that my Crobat will definitely do a little more damage. And it works out perfectly, actually. Um, actually, it works out perfectly well. Now, the last Pokemon he sends out is his Zapdos. With this, I already know what I'm going to do. I just Shadow Sneak it, and that is the end of the match. Now, if you guys went ahead and enjoyed it, go ahead and leave a like. If you didn't really like it that much, go ahead and leave a dislike. It's not like, like it matters to me. <laughs> but anyways, if you guys really enjoyed, go ahead, leave a subscription. And last, but very much not least, well, just go ahead and leave a comment. Tell me what you think. What, what do you think about my team? What do you think, like, do you get any suggestions, any... Anything like that, because I'm still trying to get prepared. I'm not exactly new, but I'm not exactly a, a veteran to the whole Pokemon battling scene. So, any advice or anything like that would be greatly appreciated. Anyways, take care my fellow deceivers and all you overachievers, and I'll see you next time.